Okay, so the next step is to perform uh, task specific customizing, okay, under the same node. So you go to SPRO, IMG, GRC, and then go to general settings, and then you come to under workflow, you have perform task specific customizing. Okay, now you come here. Now in, there may be a possibility that, you know, you don't see any nodes, okay? if the st that one particular step is not performed. So before we continue, we'll see what that program is. So we have a program to get these nodes if they don't appear. You need to execute a program. Uh, if you go to SA38 or SA38, there is a program called RS underscore APPL underscore refresh. So you need to execute this and when you do that what happens is you get these nodes okay in case this node don't don't come up when you come to this transaction in this screen if you don't see the sub nodes you execute that program okay which is rsappl refresh and that would get you these nodes okay so once, okay, to, to continue with uh, task specific customizing, then you come to GRC and then you click on assign agents. Okay, so in this step, what you need to do is wherever you see a blank row okay blank under general or background task wherever you see a blank against the task id okay you need to make all of them as general task okay so this is also a little time consuming step but uh, we need to do this okay so let's do this can see this one Select the task and click on attributes and then select general task. Okay, so select the next one and go through the same process, same steps. Okay, it's for every blank or empty task ID. Okay click on select the task and then click on attributes and then select general task so you need to do that for for to do this for all of them okay okay so let's go the last this one and i'm going to pause the video after this okay so, and i'll do the rest so that i don't want this video to be too long Okay, so I'm going to do, from this point on, I'm going to pause the video now and complete the remaining task IDs. And resume the video after it is done, okay? Okay, so we, if you see, I've um, made everything as a general task for the ones that were, didn't have any entry under general and general background task okay so once this is done now you click on activate event uh, right and then click on and see if this work these entries are activated or not so everything that you see right now are deactivated so we need to activate these also okay so let's go and see what all is that? none of them are activated right okay so we need to activate this so what you do what you're doing so we just assign the general task to the agent under assign agents right for the ones that were didn't empty here 
under this column the next thing that you need to is activate the event linking okay and for that you need to go to this ws related ent entries okay i'm going to expand them again uh, there's unfortunately there is mm -mm. No mass way of doing this, so you have to do it one by one. Okay, so I'm going to do this now. Okay, so all of them are deactivated, right? So click on and just say event linkage, no errors, and don't do anything else here. Okay, so just select this event linkage activated checkbox. Not happening. Oh, okay, let's say. Do not change linkage. Let's try this, see what happens with this. Okay, let's click on this. So if you see, what happens is it automatically, when you click on deactivate it, for some reason this is not doing it. Oh, okay, I know what happened here. Let's come back to this again, okay? So I'm going to do this. And we are going to check again, okay? So what happens is when you do this, this is unchecked, right? Even linkages. Okay, so when you click on deactivate it, it's going to act, we are basically activating it, okay? So once this is done, we're going to check that box again. See, it is not, now it's checked. Okay. So this one is a problem because we have, I'll show you what, it, what happened. Okay, so this one is, Zero, zero, 001 right so let's finish these steps first so it's going to prompt for every thing okay so you put that in your transport request Okay, so this one is not active, right? So why? That is because in the assign agent step, what I did was, which I should not have done for this one, I assigned general task. I should not have done that. Okay, so I'll say no general task. Okay, now it's gone. Now let's go back to that step. Activate linkage and take the first one. Okay, why is it not working? Let's 
go back and come back in again. So this is some for some reason Okay. Let's see. Okay. Now it's activated, right? All right. So these are the steps that you need to do or perform for task specific customization so first step that you need to do is you go and assign general task for all the tasks that do not have an entry or uh, anything under general or background task column okay for all of those tasks so you go and select the task then go to attribute and specify it select general task for all of them you don't touch the W, the ones that start with WS, okay? For the WS ones, you come to activate linkage and then scroll down and activate. If it is deactivated here, you, you activate it, okay? When you activate, it is going to ask you to put it in, uh, uh, put the change in a transport request that you, you do that and then it becomes activated okay so so this is a okay so we have done this step right so we performed automatic workflow customizing where you see everything is green ensure that every all of these entries are green and then then you perform task specific customization okay so the next step that you need to do is activate linkages for access control workflow now there are two ways you can do that okay one you can click on change event linkage uh, this option and there here you go into the change mode you're in the change mode and then you activate each and every linkage right for all the ones that have grac okay so yeah you can either do come from change event linkage, change event type linkage for object type GRC, or you can execute the transaction as WE2. Okay, you get to the same screen. So I'm going to close this because this is, we can under SPRO, so SPRO, IMG, GRC, then you under workflow, general settings, right? GRC, general settings, then workflow, and under workflow, you have change event type linkage for object type GRC. Okay, so let's see that in the next video.